it's Relly Girl. Welcome back to House Flipper Friday. Today we're going to finish up work on the Pink Kingdom and it will no longer be a Pink Kingdom. I did a few extra things in this room here. I just wanted to show you real quick. I added a clock to the wall. I replaced the mouse and keyboard that fell onto the floor. I don't know why, but they did. And I also put a new picture on the wall over here. I think that helped put a little bit of something there. It just needed something. All right, so we're gonna finish up with these two rooms. I'll start in the smaller of the two. This room here was made into a closet, but I think it would be nice as a little child's room. So I'm gonna close this door. If I can get it to close, come on. Why are you not closing? There we go. And I'm going to paint it, but I'm not gonna leave it pink. So let's see, paints. I wanna do something that could be either for a boy or a girl. Faded Lemon is a very pretty color. I may go with that. All right, let's see. I think I may have used this in the base, uh, bathroom downstairs. I'm not sure. But I think this is a good color. If you add some blues, because blue can be for boy or girl, yellow is boy or girl. We won't worry about it. This is a tiny little room, so we're not going to get a lot in here, but I just didn't feel like it should stay a closet. This will give a couple more people the option of this house. Not a lot to paint in here, is there? Pretty small. And I may change the car to carpet in this room, too just to do something a little bit different on the floor. Now should just be it under here. And one more actually. There we go. Let's go ahead and sell the rest of that. And now I'm going to put the floor in real quick here. So it's gonna be under floor panels and coverings. I don't know if this would be pretty or if the blue would be better. So let's try the blue. And then I'll decide which I like better in here. Oh, come on now. It's not catching. It must not be close enough. Come on. Okay. Let's open this up, take a look. I think I like, hmm, I like both of them. I don't know. I think I'll go with the lighter color. Okay, so let's see. Let's do the bed and then I'll worry about the curtains. We need just a little bed, something, with a little color in it. What color frame do I like? That's a nice frame. The striped bed will probably work just fine in here. Look at that. That's cute. Okay. Now we need to put something here before I go any further. And I can't put anything in there. So we'll do a blind first. Come on. Okay, and now we'll do the curtain. I think I may go with something short because I'm probably going to put a dresser under that. So let's see what would look good in this room with that bed. Is there like a little stripe one? I don't think that's quite right. Nope. I don't know if that orange is right either. Silk red. Hmm. I'm going to try the orange. I don't know. That might not be the right orange to match that bed. If not, I'll try the red and see. 
All right, let's see. It's pretty close. I think I'm going to leave that that way. Yep. Okay, so over here, we need to put some kind of a little cupboard in a dresser. Let's see. Nothing too tall, so... What about this? I could do it in the beach to try to match that bed a little bit. It does pretty good, doesn't it? Okay. Now let's do a little table, if I can. There's tiny little ones here. So we'll stick one here and put a little light on it. Just a small light will do in here. This is a mini night light or mini lamp. I don't know what you call it. Okay, orange. Oh, that looks more yellow, doesn't it? What about orange dots or yellow dots? No, let's just try orange and see. It might look a little better than I think. That's not bad. Let's get up here closer and turn that on. Okay, that lights it up good. Okay, so this little corner right here, I feel like it needs something there. I wonder if I could stick a little chair in here, in the corner. Like, would this fit? Let's see what we have color-wise. See what red looks like in here. That's not going to be bad. Need somewhere to sit. So that's good. That works. Now let's go ahead and do something for the walls. Hmm. I don't know if this, whoa, what the world? I don't know if that would look good on the wall. Is it straight? Why do I feel, oh, there we go. Felt like it wasn't. That's good. Now do they have kids stuff just in here I guess it would be in here under other here we go we can put out some of these little decorations here and there just to show that it is a little kids room or even a guest room I mean I'm sure the people that buy the house could always refurnish it the way they want let's do a little blue bunny can we put him on the bed? No. We can put him over here. That's kind of cute. Need to just fill this up with some toys here and there. Nothing in the chair, so let's see if we can put him here. Is that it as far? Oh, here's a bear. It's too pink. I wish I could put him on the bed. Maybe we could put the bear over here, sleep on the floor in the corner. All right. I'm sure we could find another toy or something to put down there. We have blocks. Here's a ball. Put a ball down there. I don't think I'm going to put any blocks out. I guess I could, but maybe a book right here. And why not a plant to dress it up in here, too? Let's do a blue plant. And then we'll just go ahead and put some pictures on this wall. There aren't a lot of kid-looking pictures. Let me go over here. I'm going to take these. And stick them in that other room. Maybe just one of them. Or... I don't know. A couple... Maybe I'll do both. I'll just do one in each corner here. Like that. That decorates that up a little bit. 
now to find something else to put here. I don't know. Maybe I'll just go with these red ones across. Try to get them as straight as I can, too. As far apart and as straight as possible. I think that's pretty good. The reflection off of them is weird. Oh, those halogens aren't even on on the ceiling. Let's see what that looks like with those. Oh, they're all off. What? Oh, here we go. It's hard to tell how bright it is in here. Because it's such a small room. When you go to leave, the lights turn out, so... Just moving them around a little bit more to space the light out. I don't even think I need that one there. Because I think that little light there does good. Let me just sell this one. And then move these ones out a little bit. Kind of like this. That's good. That works pretty well there. Okay. So, whoop, what am I on? I'm on the chair? How do I get on the chair? I know I have a carpet, a rug, or carpet in here, but I was wondering if maybe just a little rug, something decorated will look cute on that too. Carpets. Let's see, do we have any little kid style? Doesn't look like it. But maybe a little round colored thing here. Lime might look kind of cute. Bring out the color in the oh. bed there. Yeah. Okay. I'm going to call this little room here done. We've got two bedrooms in this house now. Pretty cute. There are two of these things to turn on lights here. I don't think we need to, so I'm taking one out. And this door, I don't know. I don't think you can, you can't just grab it, can you? Uh-uh. I'm going to have to take this door out and put a new one in since it was actually put in the house incorrectly. Oh wow, look at this. We have sliding glass doors to choose from now. That's really cool. I think this is the door I'm looking for here. Okay, so it needs to go in this way. There we go. Now we can open it and head on into the bedroom here. Oh my gosh, this wall color is horrible, horrible, horrible. Let's do away with a lot of this pink. I think I'm probably not even going to use this shelf in here. It takes up a lot of room. But oh my goodness, this is a lot of stuff. If I could keep these books, can I keep these books? I can. I'm going to keep those books because I don't think I can recreate those may use them here or put them somewhere else in the house. Huh. There, that makes that a little easier, doesn't it? Get rid of that. Get rid of that. Get rid of these. Um, I'm going to get rid of that. TV. I don't know if I even want this in here. Probably not. Let's just let's just clean it all out. Okay, I'll leave those plants. It's the only thing I like. Paint. Let's see. Want a pretty pink color. Oh, dirty pink? Nope, that's not going on the wall. Wow, some of these are just those crazy wild colors. What do I want to do? see what this one looks like. This delicate cacao, I guess is how you say it. I'll start over here. Oh wow, that's such a pretty color. It looks like I'm going with a lot of similar colors in this house, except for the child's room. That's a little different. Bathroom's a little different, but that's okay. So it doesn't all need to be the same for sure. But I like how this looks. I think this will make for a really pretty master bedroom. See that little texture you can see right there? Of the pink. I can't do anything about it. 
It seems to be a little, I don't know if you'd call it a glitch or just a texture problem within the game there. But that's okay. It's really not that noticeable. I think it'll be just fine. Just about done. This should be it right here. Yes, no more pink in this house. On the walls. Oh my gosh, it looks so much better. Okay, floors are great. I think I'm just going to stick with those floors. So now, let's find a bed. We could do a really pretty big bed in here. I don't want to do the same style bed. Maybe something like this. That double bed Hermes. That's very pretty. I don't really care for that one. This double bed elegance is very pretty. Let's see. I like the gray. Let's see what this looks like here. Oh wow. That's very dressy. I want to make this bed. I don't like it being messy. Look at that. Okay. All of my people are shifting around here. I was just watching them shift. I don't know why people were mad that it looked like people were mad about another bedroom. I don't know. It's kind of weird. Anyways, I don't pay too, too, much, too terribly much attention to it because you always make money in this game no matter what. <laughs> Alright, tables. I want some little side tables. Um... Hmm. What kind of side table do I want? Wish there were a little more to choose from here. I don't like... I don't want to put the same exact one in here. I don't like that color. If I could change the color of this, unless it matches the bed. Oh my gosh, that's huge. That's not what I thought it was. I thought that was just a little table. I was looking at the wrong thing. That's this coffee table. Stylish stools are, are nice, but I couldn't get the light on it last time. I will try it again because look how pretty that is. Let's see. Let's put a lamp. I'll just try this one. Oh, I don't want to go black. Gold metal. What? Oh, I did white. Gold metal. Ooh, that's pretty. White or stylized ceramic. I guess I'll keep it that way. But look. You can't put a light on these tables, and I swear before that you could. So that just does not make any sense to me. There's these beautiful little tables that you could use as a side table, but you can't use as a side table. So let me just get rid of it. Find something else. Really, my only other choice to fit in there is going to have to be this little guy here. Everything else is too big. That's like a microwave table for a kitchen. <laughs> then we have coffee tables, dining tables. This color, if you can change it, maybe that would work. But I don't like the colors because that color is too purple. I don't want to go with purple in here. So I've got to go with this. Let's do a dark walnut. It doesn't match perfectly, but I don't want that purple color in here. Oh, I could have uh, bought many. I've never tried that yet. I'll have to remember to do that sometime. The buy many feature. Let's try that with the lamp, actually. I think I'm going to go stylized ceramic. Okay, look, we're using the buy many. There we go. Now I don't need any more, so how do you get rid of it? Um, press, blah, blah, okay. So it was just the right, right mouse button. Switch. That's pretty. Oh, I don't like this thing. I was like, where's all that extra light coming from? I didn't even realize this was up there. Let's get rid of that. I don't like that. So when I turn the switch on now, it doesn't turn those on. So I have to turn those on like that. Yep. Okay. There we go. How's that look? It looks very nice. I like the walls. They're very chocolate colored. That's a very pretty color. I'm going to move this out of the way for right now because I need to put the dresser over here and it would be nice to put a chair in the corner. Maybe a rocking chair. Oh look, it's rocking. That's pretty cool. If I can fit it here, 
I'll put it here. Let's see. Um, what angle is going to let it fit? It's trying. Is that too... I think it's not going to work in here. Let's try a different little chair. Maybe like this. Yeah. That's a little better. That kind of match matches the bed over here a little bit better. Now we can do some kind of a dresser over here. So cupboards. I don't want a full length wardrobe. That looked like it goes all the way to the ceiling almost. Something shorter. So maybe this chest of drawers. That looks like I might be able to get... No. I don't know if that's going to look okay. It's so red. No, we're not going to do that one. Let's try the other one. Does this come in a better color? Oh. Dark cherry is not really red. That wood cherry is. Let's try that. I think that'll be fine. That'll work. Here we go. There. Those books, I think, could either go here. Ooh, I like it there. That's where they'll go. Over here, I'd like to put a mirror. Let's see. There are, or is, a mirror somewhere. So I'm going to search this way. There we go. And is there anything that's dark? The oak? Whoa. The oak may look all right. Oh, I like the reflection. That seems to be kind of new. I don't remember seeing reflections in the mirrors before. That's really cool. Of course, now we need to put out plants. I love this plant here. I think it would get good right there in the corner. And then we need something for on top of this. Probably something a little smaller. I don't know. I always want to use this, but I feel like the base of it is just way too big. Let's see what this looks like. Can I get it fit there? See, I think that's fine. That other base, I don't know. It just feels like it's too big. I need to turn this a little bit, I think. This way. I'm trying to get it to where it's not poking through the wall so much. That's good. That'll work, I think. But I don't know. That other one, I just, I don't like it. Okay. Pictures. I want to put, let's put another kitty picture in here. Down here looks like a good spot for the kitty. And now... I want to think about a rug. I wish there were some more little decorations that I could put on this dresser. I'm going to look through here real quick and see if there really is anything that might look good. Other than vases, but that looks like that's probably going to be it. They really don't have, you know, like little personal details because I guess you're trying not to be too personal with the house when you're trying to sell. I don't know. The kid stuff's pretty personal though. Let's try this. And I'm going to turn it a little. That's not bad. Maybe I will lay a book on there too. Where are the books? Let's do it the other way. Okay. I've got a few things on there. I want to do a carpet. But what carpet? Um, this I don't know. This might be too yellow. Oh, and it's way too small. Never mind. Let's try something else. I think that's a big one. But the gray, is that too gray compared to the chocolate? It looks good with the bed. Let me see. I'm just going to put it right there. I could go with one of these, too. That's 
kind of childlike, isn't it? I didn't really pay attention. Let me take this out. I don't think I'm going to be able to put it anywhere. Nope. Okay, I'll just sell it, and if I want it again, I'll get it back. That's all. Blue? I don't know. Ooh, and it's very small, but it might look cute right there. Let's see, does the blue look good with this? No. Don't really like the blue. Let's try. This is a carpet runner. Way too long there. I don't think I'd like it against the bed. Nope. Okay. I may not put a rug in here if I can't find one that I like enough. Let's see. That's pretty. That might do. That adds a little color. I like that. I wonder if I need to move this up just a little. Not that way. What in the world? There. That's better. That's a little higher on the wall. Okay. So. Blinds. Let's do an open blind. This would be a nice double blinded window because it's so big. Which I really like that you can do that. That's great. There we go. And now we need to find something to put over that. A short wide, this one. I'm thinking I'm probably going to... I think the brown would be way too brown. So I think I'm just going to go for the gray flowers. I like that. Oh no, I can't do the wide. So does that mean I can't put a curtain in this window? Let's find out. Let's do this one. Gray flowers. I can do the shorter of the two, so I guess I'll just go with that. I think that wall there is hindering me. The corner wall. Okay, let's see how this looks. Oh, that's nice. It's not quite wide enough for the window, but it's better than nothing. Okay, let's do some paintings. We're about done with this. This is really cool. Ooh, I really like this, and I think this was a pretty, pretty color for this room. So, we'll put that there. Yeah, look at that. Isn't that pretty? That's very nice. And maybe something smaller. Um, let me go this way. Over here. Let's see. It seems to be a bit high compared to the mirror. That's pretty good. I might do another one. Not the same color. Is this really big? I feel like that's really big. Yep. Do we have a smaller one? Hmm. Maybe a couple of these. Let's do this one. I just want to do something a little different here on this wall, I think. There. That's kind of cute. Now we need something bigger over here, but what? I guess I could go with that beachy one that I couldn't do on the other wall. Let's see. How am I liking this? I don't know. I might like that. And I don't know if I need another picture over there or not. I don't know. This is bothering me a little bit. It feels like it needs something here, but I don't know what. I don't feel like that picture is right there. It seems to be a little too square. I've got the square picture above the bed, so I don't think I want to do another square. But I don't know what else I want to put here. Rectangular something, I'm thinking. Um, what about this? Is this a big picture? Whoops, it's like... Not real big, so maybe I'll stick that over here. Is it upside down? I cannot tell. 
No, it's right side up. Okay, that's pretty. So maybe another little rectangular or a larger rectangular one here will do it. But I've got to find... Ooh, this is really pretty here. Not very big, but I think it'll be okay. It's about the same size as that one. That's good. Okay, so let me look at this. Um... I'm still not sure. I don't think I like this enough to keep it. But I'm trying to figure out what I want to put there. I feel like I need something. I use this a lot, but it's so pretty I may go with it. Anyway, I kind of like it sticking out of the bed. Let's see. That gray is good because it matches that. The curtains, I mean. Pull some gray from the bed. Yeah, I think I'll like that. I'll go with that. Now we need something over here for a light. Um, if I had more choices on little lamps, I'd stick one there, but I don't really like any of those to go there right now, what we have. So I think I'll just do, oh, that not that, ceiling lamps. I think I'll do another halogen or two here on this side. All right, let's turn them on and see. That should lighten this corner up. Yeah. That does nice. That's very pretty. That curtain bothers me that it's too short, but when you look at it this angle, it's not bad. So when you're coming in the room and you're seeing it from that way, it's, it's really not too bad at all. Okay, well, I think that might be it for this. That one little guy there. Let's move these both in a little bit so you can actually see them a little better. Because they kind of get lost behind the curtains there. There. How's that? That's better. Looks good to me. Okay. So, we've got the master bedroom done. Looks very nice. And then we have the child's room over here. And of course, if the people don't want it to be a child's room, they could always change it to just a little guest room. That looks good. I think that's it for this house then. We've got everything else done. I can't do anything about these chairs out here. You unfortunately can't put anything out here. I'll show you. Let's see. Let's just pick another chair. See? You can't place anything. I could get rid of them, but I like the idea of having chairs out on the patio, so I'm going to leave them. Just can't do anything. Hey, look! Look what I missed! Oh my gosh! Just that one side of the window. Well! Okay, what color was this? I think this was gray beige. Let's see. Gray beige. I believe that was it. I've got to fix that. That'll bother me if I don't. Okay. Is that it? All of that paint for one little piece that I missed. Okay, well, that's good. That was it. So, we've got our nice bathroom all done in here. We've got our dining room, kitchen. Over here is the garage. Didn't do too much with that. Then, did I say living room? We've got our living room. Upstairs, we have our office, kids room, and mom and dad's room. So let's go outside and see if we can get this place sold. Look at this, the pink kingdom is no longer pink. Look how nice it even looks from outside in now. Before you could see all that horrible pink and it looked absolutely ridiculous. Now it looks so much prettier. All right, I'm going to hit enter and sell this house. So we bought the house for $144,977.14. How much did we put into it? Does it tell me? Oh, it doesn't look like it tells me, does it? I thought it did. I don't know. Anyways, let's go ahead and start the auction. Okay, that guy doesn't want a kitchen. 
Tenants value two bathrooms. Oh well, I'm sorry, but I'm single, so I don't need two bedrooms. This one wants a bedroom in his house, but only one. There's no big family room. This person always says the same thing. I've offended the honor of his masculinity. Why are there toys here? He wanted one bedroom, not two. A big family needs two or more bathrooms. At least two. So the old couple wins today. There are too many rooms, but they still like it. So they offered 178, 545, 37. I'm going to negotiate that because I want some more money. I mean, I worked really hard on this place and made it really pretty. Let's try 16 to 71. All right, what are they going to say? We'd be glad to live here. They said yes. Okay, here we go. Here's what we what we did. So we're making a profit of 31,000 $162.35. Wow, we did a lot of renovating. That's great. Okay. So let's go ahead and accept that offer. Oh, here we go. Here's what it's going to be now, I think. Did that change? I think it did. I just forgot what I said. <laughs> Who knows? But I think that's a win, making $47,423.38. Let's accept that. That's awesome. Sold another house after working on it for a while. It's no longer the horrible pink thing that it was. Okay, well, that is it for this episode. Next episode, we'll, we'll buy us another house and see we, what we can get into. Thank you so much for joining, everybody. I hope that you liked this episode. If you did, please give me a thumbs up and remember to subscribe. I'll see you on the next House Flipper Friday video. Bye-bye.